April is Poetry Month, and all month long we've been reading your poems on the theme Emergence. So this poem, it's a few lines, but I remember reading it and how it really exemplified the feelings of this week, but also this year during the pandemic. The title is In the Time of Plague, April 2020 to 21, after Thomas Nash and John Webster. All the flowers of the spring adorned our social distancing as that year's mating morning doves ignored the passing of our loves. I can't in conscience take offense at their a complete indifference, knowing how my own joys and sorrows blind me to others' lost tomorrows. Wow, that's beautiful. That was sent in from listener Anita Feldman. I understand you brought a poem of your own to share with us today. Would you take us out with it, please? Yes, so this is an excerpt from my poem lineage, and it's in honor of Earth Day, which just happened last week. We do not inherit the earth from our ancestors. We borrow it from our children. A Native American proverb. There is a daughter here. She's been taught how to sustain on seas, but to never settle for them. To treat the grounds as she treats her body. To till the earth until she too is the sun. When morning arrives, she finds the shattered reflection of her mother and recalls the pieces. Countless oceans converging where she stands. You can hear an echo of lineage. The sound of a thousand daughters, mothers, sons, and fathers. How they become a garden. How their voices bloom among the scattered bones. And carry, like seeds, to wind. <laughs> 